We've got a moment. We're going to send it over to Doris Burke for our Spark of the Game, presented by Sprite. Doris? Thanks, Kevin. It's the Clippers with the Spark of the Game with that push we saw. Their offense heated up in the third quarter, and that changed the complexion of this basketball game, guys. And thank you, Doris. That run was a defining moment for sure. Yep, that's exactly when it all came together. Yeah, what's going on everybody? I'm back, baby. It's the fourth quarter. Black Mamba versus the greatest of all time. Let's get into it, man. So, it's the fourth quarter. I've been uploading this thing for the last few days. I know y'all been watching because I've been getting to all the feedback. I've been commenting back. And it seems that y'all like the way I cut it up into four parts, man. Um, you guys won't be seeing every video like this from me. I will still be cutting up an entire 50-hour video into about 12, 13 minutes for you guys. But I just wanted to do this because I felt as though, you know, it was epic, man. I haven't really seen too many people try a, a, a Kobe versus Jordan video on YouTube. So that's why I really cut it up the most like this. But look at Kobe trying to go crazy on me. I ain't, ain't going to let all that happen. But look at this. Hall of Fame BS. Lamar Odom just hit a three out of nowhere just because he had a little bit of separation. Now, this only happens because you're playing a Hall of Fame. Like, they really don't hit these shots on pro. Now, look, I'm going to do my assignment. Come out. Try to get past Kobe real fast. Look at this. Plucked. <laughs> now, I'm not going to be able to catch Shannon. So, look at that. God darn. He does have hops like that in real life. I ain't even gonna lie. It's all good though. Here's Gordon. All right, I'm gonna try another play. Let's see if this works. Ah, I can't hit that three to save my life. I swear. Yo, I'm 20% from the three point line. Like, it's crazy. Like, I don't know why I can't hit those shots, man. I did want to talk a little bit about some things this this game, but I'm going to try to stay into the gameplay a lot. Now, I'm going to try to pull up, but I'm going to ah, can't do it. Yo, I love that Jordan pump fake. Yo, that's one thing I do like about having this my player. That Jordan pump fake is crazy, man. All right, you can see they trying to get the ball to Kobe. Like that's all he, that's all they've been doing this whole game, man. Trying to get to Kobe. All right, now it's a defensive three-second violation. That's totally stupid because Nene is just standing there, not doing nothing. So, oh, another thing I want to know is why is Shannon Brown shooting defensive three-second violation free throws when I thought Kobe Bryant had the best free throw on the team? But you know, we're not even gonna worry about that. That might have been a presentation fail or something like that. You know, that tend to happen when you play NBA 2K11 because this game is full of glitches, full of mistakes. Pre, It's just stupid. Like, All right, now, that right there, that layup that I just did was a presentation foul. I got fouled by, like, three different people, and I didn't get a call at all. It's stupid, like. All right, let's get this popping. Come on, Gordon. Show me what you got, man. Come on. I got to hit this. Yes. There we go. We down three. Trying to come back, man. It's pretty hard to come back against the Lakers, man. I know everybody thought that I was going to blow these guys out of the water, but you got to remember that this is my player that I have. He is not a 99 overall. Um, also, I want to clear up a lot of things that people have been saying about this my player. That's just exactly what he is. He is a mob player. He's a, he is not a created legend. So this is not Michael Jordan's created legend mode. This is actually my player mode. So when everybody is thinking, hey, well, why didn't you just play created legend? Or, hey, isn't he supposed to be 79 overall at default? No, this is not created legend. This is regular mob player. I brought him up from a 47 overall, I think it was. It was something like that. Something crazy. But um, if anybody does want to see Michael Jordan in creating a legend mode, 
on this channel and you want to see like me go to my favorite team which is the Sixers by the way if you guys want to see that just just let me know ah yo I can't believe I missed that that was another presentation fell I was supposed to go to the line yo sometimes 2k be pissing me off but you know I'm not going to rage trust me I'm not going to rage um but I do want to tell everybody about the epic fail that I did have when I first recorded this gameplay now no lie I recorded this gameplay over a week ago, right? Now, when I first recorded the gameplay, I recorded it with the bad headset that I had for uh, two of my videos. I had the bad headset for the So You Think You Can Commentate series guidelines, and I had it for the Madden 12 demo. Now, if you listen to both of those videos, you can tell that there's a lot of background feedback from my headset. Now, when, I ain't gonna lie, I recorded the entire game live I was gonna bring out a live commentary uh, video for everybody like it was gonna be like one of the first ones I ever had you know me raging me being pissed off at Hall of Fame difficulty me just going crazy on the mic I mean crazy but I had an epic fail I went back I listened to the audio and I swear to you not it sound like I was in a Sahara Desert somebody's freezer <laughs> like yo I mean the the feedback from the background was so crazy that I couldn't even restore the audio I couldn't even fix it I couldn't even I couldn't even make it liable to hear like I just couldn't do anything with the audio so I sent the audio to uh, Wiser now he tried to see what he could do because you know he's the king of power director or whatever that's when I that's what I recorded the uh, entire live commentary and I recorded it inside power director so you know that's another epic foot fell right there why didn't I go to the line but Blake Griffin could get called for a loose ball foul are you serious all right back to, back to what I was talking about so I sent it to wiser now he said yo hey yo my man what headset you got I said yo man I got the same joint you told me to buy he was like like you lying I was like I swear to God so I told him which one I brought right tell me why I brought like the Plantronics 6, 626 and he told me to get the 646 so you telling me from one digit off I got the worst headset in history like <laughs> I was so mad like just imagine recording for an entire hour and you actually like can't use none of the audio I was sick to my stomach I tried to put music over it it wouldn't help I, I tried everything man it was just it was just a total fail so at least I got these Tritons now you know these Tritons are doing me justice I hope you guys like the way these commentaries are sounding hope I'm sounding clear enough I hope you guys you know can hear what I'm saying you know yeah Kobe I see you hold on gimme ah oh. come on double team alright now Odom just missed that three right tell me why he had more space than he had on the three that he hit in the good good hop set layup but uh it's crazy how he just missed his three but he made a three and he didn't even have that much space between the, the defender and him earlier like I hate Hall of Fame it's like it's like when a shot doesn't really matter they don't hit it like it's, it's just stupid man like I hate it alright now look Bryant hit that of course you know that's because the dude that was trying to guard him was in front of me so oh I hate that too yo even though they fixed the fast break glitch what they're doing like when you pass a long court pass and you're dribbling the ball behind you I hate that or if if somebody throw you a full court pass and you end up out of going out of bounds with it I hate that like get on my nerves uh oh get some air baby ah yo I hope y'all like that dunk that I just did um, that was the dunk that Shakedown 2012 did in his um, dunk contest that we just had. You know, um, shout out to him. You know, I, I think I, I think I'm going to the next round. I need y'all to check them videos out too. Um, just go down, you can go to this page. You know, go to his YouTube page, check them joins out. It's a, it's 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 full of a bunch of commentators like myself for 2K. You have uh, me, Wiser now representing Game Face Studios of course you got uh, Shakedown 2012 and Best Act Around that just made it to the uh, second round we had some we had some good dunks to go up against um, I, pull, I pulled it out I think you know going to the final round but 
um i need you guys to check out the other set of rounds that's coming out soon i don't know when shakedown's gonna release the vids but they're gonna be up soon but if you guys want to check out round one i will leave every round all the links in the description that was another fail i should have went to the line but uh I'm going to leave the links in the description so you guys can check out the epic dunk um, contest that we're going through right now. My first dunk was a 360. I don't, if anybody hasn't seen it, trust me, you want to click the link in the description. Like, um, Listen, I did a 360 with uh, my athletic small forward. He's the featured my player inside the dunk contest. I wanted to put Michael Jordan in, but that means I would have had to work hard at putting his dunk up to a 99 so I can, you know, actually mimic what he's doing but i actually like using my athletic small forward because he's a beast six nine beast <laughs> but um yeah what you guys want to do is of course click the links in the description and if you guys want to you know join in any type of commentator dunk contest that we have or any commentating series that anyone is having i advise you to do it man it, it not not only does it help you get your name out there but at the same time it gets you known to these bigger commentators that's on youtube you know and if they if they if they mess with you like that like you actually have real life convos with people like you you don't you don't just do it just to be a fanboy like you gotta just you do it to kick it with people you know what i'm saying like you don't just come through the door and be like hey i want to have a uh, chat with you guys you hop in the chat but you mad silent the whole time like <laughs> don't be mad silent speak your mind man like we not we're not like superstars like I'm, i don't know how to explain it like we regular people yo like real talk no bull crap we are regular people just like you man we breathe the same air like <laughs> real talk but we definitely appreciate you, you know what i'm saying looking up to us because we do it for y'all like real talk like we we do it for y'all and and we want to see how you know y'all like the way we do things and if y'all want to see us switch anything up we definitely like the way y'all be commenting you know and if y'all be wanting to see more we'll do it you feel me but back to the game man I'm down by seven. It's two minutes left in the game. Like, I'm down seven. I'm going to pull up for this three. Green release. Perfect release. And I missed the three. I've been having perfect release all game. And I've been missing these threes. Like, now, I ain't going to lie. My, 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 my three had like a 70, right? But I should be hitting these. Like, look at this. Look at it. Oh, my God. How do you make that shot? We both double teamed you. You walked because... I don't care what nobody said. He was off his pivot. He was oh pass. Good dunk, Griffin. Like, yeah, check out this replay. Look at these dimes, man. I got court vision, man. <laughs> Real talk. Alright. We down by still seven. It ain't nothing different. Kobe trying to show off. Look at him. I can't even stick him. I don't even know who the person I'm supposed to be sticking. Ah, he missed that. We out. Hit me. Hit me, yeah. Alright, I should hit this one. Green release. Oh my god, I missed it again. Yo, perfect yo, you know what? F perfect release, yo. Real talk. F just F it, yo. Like perfect release does not help you. I don't care what nobody say. Like you just gotta you just gotta get a feeling for your player. Look at that. Hops that play up. He gets fouled. And he goes to the line. First of all, that animation is bull crap because Mo Williams shouldn't even be sticking him. Second of all, how did he hop step from the foul line to the paint on it? Oh my! You know what? I'm pissed off. In fact, I told you guys I wouldn't rage, but I'm mad because, of course, you guys see that I won't be able to win this game. Yes, I'm telling you, I won't be able to win it. I can't miraculously hit five threes just to put me put me up right now. Like it's only one minute left. I'm not Tracy McGrady, you know. And if don't nobody know what I'm talking about, Tracy McGrady hit a bunch of threes and like i think it was what like 30 seconds or something like that i i gotta watch the highlight film again but he went od like he went crazy all right i should hit this oh my god i don't even know why i didn't shoot it oh oh vintage jordan baby cash vintage jordan baby all right, now I'm 36% from the three-point line. They want to foul Kobe, one of the best free-throw shooters in the league. 
He gonna go to the line. What? Huh? Are they chanting MVP for this fool? Are you serious? They chanting MVP for him? This is this is my sports center, like. This is my highlight game. This is what I do. And they chant MVP just because they got home court? This is bull crap, man. I'm mad now. I don't even want to play no more. They chant an MVP. Like, uh, you know what? We in the stable center right now. They chant MVP. When when the, when the ESPN come on and, and you know they and the Sports Center come on and all that, they gonna say Kobe went OD on me, and he just hit a he just hit a three. I'm done. I'm done. I'm I'm pissed off. I'm, you know what? I don't even want to talk no more. You know what? This is the end of the video, guys. Um, I just wanted to say thanks for watching this saga. Um, I hope you liked it, and I'm out. Peace. Kobe lit you guys up out there tonight. Did the team try to do anything specific to shut him down? How do you react to a player that's on a roll like that? Kobe, huh? Dude hit some lucky shots out there tonight. You know what I'm saying? I mean, Kobe's the man, but tonight he was getting all the soft bounces, all the calls. I got no answers for that. I just got to try that much harder to go out there and match him when I get the ball. Coach probably should have let me guard him all game. No switches, no doubles, no nothing else fancy, though. Just man-to-man. -man. Maybe next time we'll try that, because tonight's game plan sure didn't work, right? <laughs>